Hey guys, and here I'm filming the latest generation Super GX hat from my Akai 9100. And as you may see, I'm not happy with this residue which stuck on the playback head. This would limit our ability to reproduce high frequencies, so I will do a deep cleaning now. And on the recording head, let me see. Maybe different angle will work better. Here. Just too much light. It's too bright. So here is the gap. I've been able to see it with different angle. Uh, let me find. Here we go. Here. Come on. Here is the gap. On the middle of the white spot. So looks pretty nice. So recording head is perfect, but without a microscope, I was not able to see this micro sticky parts. And as you may see, also there is an issue with a uh, uh, gap. It has been uh, destroyed a little bit on the top with all those small cracks that's why it i had to correct frequency response on this deck uh, let me see if i can clean it up and we can see it better what's, what's... okay guys this is playback hat after deep cleaning i barely can see a gap right here it's in a perfect condition as you may see yourself so it's almost not possible to observe the, any gap and it was the latest generation so those residue i clean it so now we have nothing here and i can mention that there is a gap just because a different color on the sides and when with a large zoom i cannot see the gap so small it is so you see in any different point there is no more gap so just somewhere here see we try to choose brightness so perfect I, I am just getting lost why so on the record head I can see gap so here it is you see it's nice and perfect on the playback head or oh, here is a gap but it's so thin it's almost not possible to see and right here wow so this head is in very good condition I'm not sure why all Akai over time de degrade with high frequency performance. I had to correct like 4 decibel degradation. But now it performs like it's it's just uh, the best of all decks I have. It's even better than Nakamichi Dragon. And if you see this naked eye, uh, I told you I even was not able to see any residue there. So it was so thin and small. So can we zoom in? Okay. Right here. So with microscope, it's it's not possible. It's it's only way to see if there is something wrong is having a microscope. It's just not possible to find anything small of this size with naked eye or even with a magnifying glass. Because I, my microscope is about 70 zoom, 70 times zoom, so 
Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next parts.